With states across the country loosening COVID restrictions and more Americans getting vaccinated, people are eager to travel this Memorial Day weekend. AAA says 37 million people are expected to head out of town this weekend. That's a 60% increase in travelers compared to last year. And it looks like a lot of them are coming down here to South Florida. Our Steve King spent the day talking to visitors who are out and enjoying the Sunshine State. We are up slightly over 2019 levels. Obviously, we're well above 2020. We're expecting more visitors this weekend than we did in 2019 based on the pent-up demand coming out of, of COVID. At Juneau Beach, people here from out of state say they're thrilled to be here. We wanted to uh, just get into this blue water. Really? Yeah, yeah, the beaches in New York aren't very pretty. And it's really exciting here. They're excited to be here for many reasons. The ocean, the fish, and the food. Jory Bailey of Connecticut loves it so much she's moving here in August. We just wanted to be somewhere where we could enjoy the outside year round. Over at Palm Beach International Airport, where the number of passengers coming in and out has shot way up in the last couple months, some of the people flying in tell us they're happy they're spending their first vacation in over a year here in our area. Yeah, we've been stuck inside for 18 months, so it was time. It was overdue. Really needed it, and uh, so we're, we're going to just enjoy it, take this time to enjoy it. Leading up to it was very exciting to get out of the house and calm down to Florida where everything's nice. It's uh, always a pleasure to come here. We don't disagree. That was Steve King reporting. Tourism leaders confirm many hotel and resort room rates are up, and they say part of that is because there are fewer rooms available and they're having trouble hiring enough staff to go to full capacity.